This is how you use Prompt Genius and ChatGPT to generate questions for a podcast when you have a guest coming on. I'm going to show you the prompt that I use that I basically just fill in the brackets, fill in the blanks every time. This is Chat GPT Prompt Genius. It is a free Chrome extension. I will put a link in the description below of how to get it. These are just prompts that I've written. They are templates. It's a really easy way to use prompts over and over so you don't have to keep retyping things and you can just fill in the blanks on the kinds of requests that you have over and over again. So this one, for example, is when I'm coming up with questions for podcast guests for one of the podcasts that I produce, I would just go here. I write my prompt. I'm looking for 10 great questions to ask, insert guest name, during a podcast interview that would be interesting and beneficial for my audience. Then you hit this yellow button that says, use this prompt. It's going to open up chat GPT. And then here's where you enter the guest name. So let's say I was going to interview Whitney Cummings. So you see where all I had to do was just write the name Whitney Cummings uh, again in slow motion. Look, I'm in chat GPT prompt. Her. I know. Well, she's the best. So you go into the prompt. I'm going to paste this in the YouTube description below. It is easy. It's free. You don't have to sign up with an email or do anything annoying. It's just there for you. It's in the description. This is a short prompt that's going to get you 10 great questions for your next podcast guest. Fill in whatever applies to your show. Okay. So I have like my audience is high output individuals focused on self-improvement and gaining knowledge. Maybe your audience is like millennials who want to giggle, you know, put whatever. That's Use my the audience. prompt. Yeah, like this is for Mine's something dog lighthearted. Dog and cat lovers. Dog and cat lovers. Oh, what was the thing the other day about the bobcats and Mima? How you respond to spammers? Oh yeah, no. If a spammer spams my phone, I just come at them with the most unhinged shit I can. <laughs> I can come up with. So.